So you heard it right. No weights needed for this one, but you are going to need a towel. Um, we're going to use beach towels just because they tend to be a little bit longer and uh, either a chair, a box, or a step. So we're going to do this whole thing with you. I'm going to do the harder versions and Claudia's going to do the modifications today. So without further ado, let's, let's get into it. First one is for your biceps. We're going to use that towel. Thank you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. So we're going to use the towel <laughs> in a few different interesting ways today. The first one is going to be for just a traditional curl. I'm going to do it from a standing position where Claudia's going to do it from a seated position. This one also requires a little bit more balance. All right, so we're going to start with your pinkies down. We're going to use your uh, foot and leg as resistance and then curl your pinkies in as you come up. So the unique thing of, about this one is you get to decide how much resistance is appropriate. We're not going to count reps. We're just going to get as many good repetitions in as we can in the allotted time period. So you get to, like I said, you get to choose that resistance and don't be nice on yourself, right? Don't make it easy. Nice, good. Curl those pinkies in. Like I said, this one requires a little bit of balance at the same time. Nice. Okay, let's go 10 more seconds. Excellent. Giving yourself that resistance. Curl those pinkies in up at the top. And three, two, one, and excellent. Okay, so we can set this one down. We're going to move on to the next one. So for the next one, I'm going to do it on the ground. Claudia's going to use her, her box for this one, but like we said, you could certainly use a chair as well. We're going to move into a manual tricep extension. So we're going to uh, use our body weight as resistance. I'm going to come from the ground here. I'm only going to bend at my elbows with my hands out in front of me, coming down, touching my elbows to the ground, and back up. Easier version, as you see Claudia doing, not easy, but again, only bending at the elbows, keeping her core tight, and bending and keeping those elbows in, not allowing them to flare out. You decide which version is right for you. Good. Full range of motion, all the way up, all the way down. Feeling those triceps starting to work. Here we go in five, four, three, two, one, and done. Excellent. Okay, so we need a towel again for the next one. Similar to the first one, a little bit different though. We're gonna use a different uh, hand position. I'm just gonna move this out of the way. Yes. Here. Uh, we're gonna use a different hand position, a hammer hand position. So we're gonna have our palms facing one another, grabbing the towel on both sides. Again, we're gonna use our feet both of these movements are going to be from the standing position. We're going to bend over weights in my hips. I'm going to hit with my palms facing one another. I'm going to have my elbows at a 90 degree angle, and we're going to do an iso curl. So that means isometric, just hold, pull and hold. I'm going to hold for the whole 30 seconds. Claudia is going to pull for five seconds, relax, and then back up. So you decide if you want to go the whole time or if you want to do it in smaller intervals. Good. Keep pulling and try to keep those elbows at a 90 degree angle, right? So see that angle that my elbows are on. Try to get there and keep it there. Excellent. So those biceps working. We're moving around, hitting all the different bicep and tricep heads today. All the different muscles of the arm are going to get hit in this workout. Good. Not much left. Give me five more seconds. And four, three, two, one and done okay good moving on to the next one going back to the triceps we're going to do a close grip push-up so from the ground i'm going to do a push-up uh up on my feet and claudia is going to do it from her knees we're going to have our hands shoulder width apart up into that high plank position i'm going to keep my elbows in as i travel down up against my side and back up full range of motion so yes this one is going to work your chest and your shoulders a little bit, but if you keep those elbows in, really helps hit the triceps back of the arm. Full range of motion. And if you have to mid set, no big deal switching from this top position to the bottom position on your knees, because even that one is not, not easy. easy. No, it isn't, is it, Claudia? Nope. These are always my favorite. Read least favorite is what she means. <laughs> I always get the eye roll anytime I tell her we're doing them. Ah, good, not many left. 
fighting through guys let's go in five four three two one and done oh. okay coming back up towel again we're gonna do a reverse pull out curl so grabbing your towel again hands are about shoulder width apart this time on the towel palms are down wrists are straight elbows are in tucked into our side we're gonna get a full range of motion curl but we're pulling out the whole time like you're trying to spread that towel and pull that towel apart really gonna feel this one in your forearms and your grip <laughs> works pretty quick huh I know it, it does. doesn't it doesn't <laughs> look like much I mean you're just pulling the towel apart but it really blasts those forearm and bicep muscles I like this one good pulling apart so even when you're at the top and at the bottom don't stop pulling apart excellent not much left on this one good give me five four three two one good okay so towels at the side we're gonna need that chair that box again i'm gonna grab one we're doing a chair dip so claudia's gonna do it with her uh knees bent and i'm gonna do it with my legs out straight which makes it a little bit harder and if you really want to kick up the intensity i'm not going to do it today but you can also ele elevate your feet to make it just that much harder so but the key is when you're doing this one not to use your hips notice how claudia's not bringing her butt up like this while she's doing it but instead she's keeping those knees bent throughout really trying to make the triceps do the work leaving everything else out of the equation good fighting through breathe feeling it i'm feeling it <laughs> <laughs> and five four three two one and done good job okay Ooh. that's the end <laughs> That's the end of the first round. We got one more round to go, everybody. Okay, so one round down, one to go. If you need some water, now's the time. Otherwise, shake you those can, arms out. Yeah, shake them, get rid of that lactic acid. I know, just for being <laughs> half towel and body weight workout, we're gonna get it good today, I promise. Okay, five more seconds, then we're getting back into that st either standing or seated curl. And three, two, one and go so remember we're going curling pinkies up and in on the way up so at the very top curling those pinkies in getting that extra bicep contraction if you're doing the standing version working on your balance at the same time <laughs> nice push yourself on this one you get to control that resistance don't be easy on yourself let's go remember what you came here for what's your why what goal are you working on? How do you want those arms to look, feel? What kind of strength do you want them to have? Focus on it. Something made you start this workout today. Excellent work. We got five, four, three, two, one, and done. Good. Okay, moving on to a manual tricep extension. So for this one, we're going to our knees. Claudia's going to use her chair, her box. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to do it just on the ground. Further out in front, you put your hands, the harder this one gets. You just drop those elbows down. And the further out you put up. your knees on this one, the harder it is. Also true, exactly. So the more underneath you are, the easier it'll be. Wrapping them out, getting as many in as you can in that allotted time period. And if you really want to kick it up, you can come up onto your feet and do them from here. You decide which one is right for you today. Ooh, I feel those triceps burning. Oh my goodness, do I ever. We did a upper body workout video yesterday too. Ooh. We're feeling it. <laughs> nice work guys, we don't have much left. Stay focused, get those abs tight. Give me five, four, three, two, one, and done. Oh my goodness. All right, we're up on our feet. Let's keep that pace up. Let's see if these triceps have any gas left for, <laughs> for the <laughs> chair dips. Oh, yeah, and the push-ups. I forgot about those. Ooh. Okay, we're doing hammer curl next with the towel. So getting that hammer grip, that means palms facing one another like we're hammering, right? So grabbing each side, bending over, getting in that absolute perfect position where you can get your elbows at a 90-degree angle and just pull. 
So you see, find what that right combo is. If it's just pulling the whole 30 seconds, if it's five seconds in rest, if it's 10 seconds, if it's two, whatever it is, push yourself. Let's go. Nice work, everybody. Go to that happy place. Pull, 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 pull. Keep those elbows at a 90. Come on. Pulling like your life depends on it. Because it does. Let's go. You got it. You got it. Pull. Give me 10 seconds. That's it. Just 10 la last 10 seconds. Almost there. And five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Oh, goodness. Okay, so moving on. I'm going to use this to put my forehead. Perfect. Have that <laughs> handy. Okay, moving on to a close grip push up. This is for my from knees. the ground. Remember, hands are shoulder width apart. We're in a high plank position. And those elbows just come up right to our sides. Full range of motion. Get those elbows to a 90 before you come back up. No shame in dropping to your knees on this one. Especially with all these other movements we've been doing. We're going hard and fast today, getting you everything you need in just these two rounds. Come back, repeat this workout, get a little bit better at it every single time. And that's how change happens. Right, your body's gonna adapt, get stronger. You got it. Not much left there, but not much left. And five, four, three, two, and done. Okay, so we're up again. We got that reverse pull out curl. So palms facing down, that's why it's a reverse. Whew. Couple deep breaths, <laughs> pulling out on that towel. All the way up, all the way down. I'm gonna need some new shirts after this one. Sorry, that was a really bad corny joke. <laughs> <It> took <laughs> not, me a minute, I was like, Not even uh, my wife laughed at it, that's how you know it's bad. Well, she doesn't laugh, that was a strikeout. All the way up, all the way down. Pulling apart everybody, pulling apart, you got it. Nice. Ah, they're burning, burn so good. Burn so good, don't stop pulling apart. Don't stop pulling apart. Don't pause this video either, come on. Let's go, fight with me, we don't have much left. All the way to the end, everybody. All the way to the end. Give me five more seconds on this one. In four, three, two, one, done. Okay, ah. to the side it goes and we got chair dips, that's it. Last one. Get your chair out, let's get some dips in and let's call it a day. All right, in position, either knees bent, legs straight, you decide, but start going all the way up all the way down full range of motion nice work everybody fighting through that burn your arms are telling you they're done but you don't have to listen to them you can push through you can persevere same thing is true in everything in life pushing through pushing through nice work not much left almost there give me five four three Two, one, zero. Ah! Oh man. Laser. That was good. Short, quick, and effective. I can tell by Claudia's face she loved it slash hated it. That <laughs> means it worked. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big old thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check out hasfit.com where we have free workouts, free meal plans, free fitness programs, all there, all for you for free. That's right. Follow us on any social media platform that you may be on because we're there we got facebook twitter snap instagram it just the list goes on and on we are there putting out motivation for you thank you for giving us the opportunity to serve you today i'm coach kozak i'm claudia and we will see you at your next workout <laughs>